Hello, 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 it's Kyle Ben Boris with Boris.com and today I'm gonna to be sharing with you a document you can use to build out a strategy to improve a part of your organization. Let's dive right in. Alrighty, so there's a tool that we have here called Strategy on a Page and this is a simple document that you can use to outline what it is that you're working on and how to track your progress against those objectives month over month. I'm going to dive into the document right now and you can get a copy of this stuff in the description down below. Before I jump in, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you like this type of content so we know to keep making it. All right. Let's jump in. Here it is, it's beautiful, right? Yes. So this is the strategy on the page. So I'm gonna go through an example. There's also a blank one that we have that you're gonna be able to use. But let me read through this example and just share with you some of my thoughts around why this is so impactful. So first are the key objectives. Exceed quota of 656,000 for any rep. Attend 15 RVP meetings, so that's five per month over the quarter. Attend 120 AE meetings, so that's 40 per month. And then meet activity goal of 600 per month month, which is 150 per week. So we have some key objectives here. And the idea is we want to make sure we're achieving these objectives. And this is from a company we've worked with before, and they were struggling doing the activity and getting consistent results from their sales team. So this is just a very, very simple outline of what they need to focus on. So you're going to notice three columns here in the table. There's strategies to win plans, and then the monthly status. And the idea here is on the left hand side, we're just outlining what the thing that we're working on is, right? So the first one here is exceed booking targets. The next one, RVP meetings, AE meetings, and sales activities. These are the things that we're working on. You'll notice they align very closely with the key objectives. The key objectives might be written a little differently, but these are just basically a category version of the key objectives. Next is plans. This is really things that you want to happen in order to make the key objective achieved. So in the case of exceed booking targets, we have maintain minimum 4X quarterly quota at all times, create two new opportunities per week, and then attain a quota of 659,992, which is what, what the key objective is. And then every month you go through and you review the status. And the idea here is in the executive meetings, you can go through, you hold this page or you put it up virtually. I'm like old school with paper and uh, you go through the monthly status. Hey, exceed booking targets. Do we have that? Are we maintaining a minimum of four X quarterly quota at all times? And they say, well, actually we're at five X right now. Oh, great. Are we creating two new opportunities per week? We're actually, uh, we're actually creating three new opportunities every week. Oh my gosh, we're, we're really doing a great job here. And then attain quota of, uh, 659,992. Well, we're doing good in all the other ones. It's really forecasting to look like we're going to exceed our quota this quarter. So we are exceeding in this example. So let's go to RVP meetings and I'll show you what lagging looks like. Have have meetings with five RVPs that I have existing relationships with. Have meetings with five RVPs that I do not have existing relationships with and introduce my manager to five RVPs that my manager does not know. So if these haven't happened and we haven't made any progress this quarter on those, we may be lagging behind. So let's say it's the last month of the quarter and none of these have happened, then it would be marked as lagging. And then finally for on target, AE meetings, have meetings with seven AEs that I do that I have existing relationships with, have meetings with seven AEs that I do not have existing relationships with, introduce my manager to seven AEs that my manager does not know. And let's say it's the last month of the quarter and we've done five of each one of these. And it looks like we have another two more happening over the course of this month. This would be an on target. So all you do is you sit down, you write out what you're trying to accomplish, how you plan to get there, that's that middle column. And then finally, month over month, track the status. And as you go through the month, you'll have a clear picture of how close you are to making your targets a reality. Alrighty, and that's it, pretty simple. One page to get everybody on the same page. So if you like that kind of content, like, comment, subscribe, let me know in the comments below. It's super helpful when I see recommendations on what we should make videos on. If you need any sort of support, don't hesitate to reach out. I look forward to talking soon. Thank you.